What's going on everybody? It's Joe from the Acceptable Casualties. Here to do a little product review of some dice that I got in from Dice of War and some tokens I got in from War Stuffed. So uh, I ended up putting an order in, I don't know, maybe like two months ago, uh, for some uh, custom tokens and some dice that I wanted to get for some early war projects that I got on the calendar that I haven't really started up just yet. So um, I ended up picking up some Iron Cross dice because I'm going to do some early war uh, Vermok on the Eastern Front uh, probably toward the end of the year. So I ended up getting, like I said, a set of the dice uh, for these. Uh, I wanted to get the Iron Cross. I just, I just always liked the way that this looked on these dice. And then, like I said, Adam over at, uh, at Dice of War. Like these, these came out awesome once again. I've never been disappointed by the stuff they put together. And then I also got a set of the, uh, the Polish dice, the Polish Eagle dice. Um, my thoughts for getting these ones on the generic side instead of getting the um, you know the the first armor division for the poles was I can use these for my uh, my second Polish corpse in Italy. I can use them for early war poles, and I'm thinking about doing uh, maybe some medieval stuff in the beginning of next year, uh, doing some winged hussars. So I figured that would work pretty well for that. So you know these the dice that I picked up multi purpose, and like I said, they look awesome too. I mean the eagles, they they really popped and came out really well. Uh, also got if you look down here, like I said, you get the uh, the dice of war tin that has the Polish eagle on front. That's the one I ended up getting for this set right here. And then I also got some tokens down here as well. This is the stuff from War Stuff. So I ended up getting uh, first Polish armor division. I might end up uh, adding some some Shermans and some stuff like that to to round this out over here. I said I already got the infantry themed. I just wanted to get some armor as well. And I really like those tokens, so I ended up getting a set of those. And uh, they give you a whole bunch of stuff. I mean, there's markers here for different um different batteries i think it's like a through d like yeah like here's like c over here um there's a whole bunch of other tokens in here you get ranged in markers um for what batteries firing as well as like all like the standard stuff uh bailed out dug in bogged down like there's a there's a mostly version three i think um version three markers in here for this stuff but uh, like I said, they, they work for version four as well. I mean, 90% of them will. You just have to make some minor adjustments with some of the ones that might be outdated now. Uh, these are the two objective markers that you get. Like I said, these are pretty sturdy too. I mean, they come um, laminated on the front. You get that felt on the back. So like, uh, like I said, they're, they're, really, they're really done well. Both of these are. So yeah, this is, uh, like I said, this is Dice from Dice of War. And then uh, the tokens are from War Stuffed. Uh, most of their stuff, not most of their stuff, but some of their stuff actually matches if you go between the two sites. So you get a matching dice set to go with some matching tokens, which is kind of nice as well if you know, you're know you like that, like kind of like how I am. I like all my stuff to kind of go together. But um, definitely worth checking out. I think the set together combined, uh, when you add it all together, it's like 30 bucks for... Uh, the dice and the tin and then 30 bucks for the tokens and then like I said if you're just doing the dice individually They're um, they're priced on on the dice of war site But usually looking around like I think like 15 to 20 bucks depending on what you're getting So like that's what you guys are looking at right now uh, You know check them out like I said both really really good products uh, You know they're worth the money that you put into it So uh, like I said thanks for watching leave some comments like subscribe all that jazz and I'll catch you guys later